Yo, it's your boy the Android Doctor back again with another video. In this video, we're going to have a look at the official Android 5.0.2 Lollipop update on the Samsung Galaxy Tab 4 10.1. This is the SMT530 model, so we're just going to have a look at some of the changes real quick. Okay, so here on the lock screen, the first thing you might notice, the digital clock has now changed places. It's now here at the top. It used to be over here to the left on the previous KitKat version. And also where it says swipe screen to unlock, that's now placed down here at the bottom. It used to be down here to the bottom left hand corner somewhere. Um, so we're just going to unlock it. And this is the UI. It pretty much looks the same. The only thing is, um, you might notice we've got a new weather widget now. This is the same weather widget which can be found on the Samsung Galaxy S5. So there it is. I pretty much prefer this weather widget. Um, but the UI is pretty much the same. It does feel a little bit smoother while scrolling. Um, the search bar, which used to be down here on the bottom left, that's now been removed and it's been replaced with a little folder icon here. And when you tap on it, you can get access to your SD storage or your device storage, um, your categories, your images, videos, audio, documents. Okay, so let's just have a look in the app tray. Okay, in the app tray, you might notice up here at the top, it has now changed. Um, before on the KitKat version, you used to have apps here to the left. You used to have widgets here in the middle and you used to have downloads here on the right. But it's now changed, you've only got apps. But that little tab still there, you can edit, create folder, view as, downloaded apps and all that stuff. Or you can hide your apps, uninstall, disable apps, and you've got your help option there. So you might be wondering how do you find your widgets? Well, to find your widgets now you just have to long press on the home screen. And you've got a shortcut here for your wallpapers. So, we've not added any new wallpapers. These are still the same wallpapers what we found on KitKat. Um, but like I said, to access your widgets, just long press on your screen and select widgets and all your widgets can be found here. And like I said, the scrolling does seem a lot smoother. So um, I'm not really going to go into much detail about this because I'm sure you're all familiar with um, Android 5.0 Lollipop. I'm sure you've seen it all um, many times before. So we'll just have a quick look at some of the changes. So um, hold on. We've got that material design with all the applications, as you can see. And when you open the recent apps tray, as you can see, we've got that card stack effect there. And you can just close them all down, all your recent apps. When you pull down your notifications here, as you can see, the toggle area has now changed. It's got a material design. And now you can just tap on there and you can add a guest user if you want. Switching to guest. Oh, 
Okay, so let's just go through this. Okay, so I'm on the guest user account here. As you can see, the home screen is pretty much standard. There's nothing on there because I'm a new user. So I'm just going to switch back to my account. So I'm switching back to owner's account there. And I get all my stuff back there. So um, let's just go into the settings area here. And as you can see, we've got all... We've got that white background there, that material background, all white. Um, Okay, so let's just go into about device and let's take a look. Like I said, this is the SMT530 model and it's Android version 5.0.2, the official lollipop. Okay, let's just come out of there. So yeah guys, this was just a quick look at the official Android 5.0.2 Lollipop on the Samsung Galaxy Tab 4.10.1. Um, I've been I've been using this firmware for the last two days now. I installed it two days ago, and so far it's really good. I've not found any problems with it. Everything seems to work fine. Um, if you've not got the update yet on your tablet, I'll be doing a tutorial this weekend showing you how to install it onto your Galaxy Tab 4.10.1. Um, also stay tuned, I'll be doing root tutorials and how to unroot and how to install custom ROMs for this tablet. So yeah, stay tuned. If you've not hit the subscribe button already, please hit the button um, so you can get my videos. You can stay up to date with my videos whenever I upload them. And thanks for watching. It's your boy the Android Doctor. I'm out. Deuces.